Welcome to Farzy's Survival World. I made this series with one goal in mind, to make the best survival world in Minecraft history. So if you like epic builds, amazing structures, and a few comical fails now and again, you do not want to miss this. Stop chasing me, you frickin' jelly bean. Stop it. Yeah, get him. Get him, Gollum. Get the jelly bean. You got it. Go. Go. Yeah. What is up, guys? We are back playing some Minecraft, and today, we're gonna have a little bit of fun. Not a lot, but a little bit. Of course, I'm joking, because every day with Farzy is a day in paradise, so you're gonna have a lot of fun and a lot of excitement. But, let's get to work! So today, I'm feeling adventurous. I want to go out on an adventure, and I want to find some cool new stuff. I really went out of my way to not adventure because I didn't want to explore too much since the cave update is coming out like this summer. So I wanted to keep all my chunks unexplored so I could get stuff close to my house if that all makes sense. But I figure we can do a little bit of exploring, just like a tiny bit. So why don't we put on our wings and go get some more something, maybe some torches and get adventuring. I don't know, I feel like Minecraft adventuring is one of the more fun things to do in the entire game. And I haven't really done it like at all recently. So that's why I'm just super excited to go do this and have some fun, find some new tings. So let's go this, let's go this way. No, this way, this way. So here's the rule. I can't go past 3,000 in any directions. So those coordinates you see right there, you can't go past 3,000. That'll be my own personal rule until the cave update comes out because I want to have new caves and new mountains and all that fun new stuff. So we're going to be kind of staying local, but it'll be fun. Don't you worry. I found a forest. Nothing special, but it's a forest. Ooh, a nether portal ruin. Don't mind if I do. Wait, oh, this one's weird. Ow. This one's like collapsed. That's cool. What do we got in here? We go, ooh, aqua. Okay, okay, okay. A mending hoe. Don't mind if I do. Vanishing pickaxe. I guess I'll take it. Why not? And I'll take the obsidian. Thank you very much. It's a bee. Ready for this? Ready for this? I'm so sorry, Mr. B. Pop. Oh, he evaded it. Wow. Oh, reinforcements and the secret gold block. Thank you. Oh, wait, there's more. I'm actually gonna take this beehive too, because I love these things. Boom, mine, and we carry on. I wanna find a jungle really badly. I haven't seen a jungle in this world in probably like two years. I mean, if even. If you guys are new to this series, I have regenerated a lot of my chunks around my world. So I kept my little kingdom area, but everything outside of that, I've regened at some point. So I think at this point in time, I have no jungles in this world yet. So gotta go find one. Ooh, some horses. Hello, horses. I don't want you. I want something cooler. Like us. More horses. Okay. A llama squad. Hello. How you guys doing? Have you heard about our Lord and Savior? No? Okay. Carrying on. Ooh, a village. Ooh, don't mind if I do. What do we got here, boys? What do we got? I don't want to make you guys die from the zombie raid, but, uh, what do you got? Any loot? We have a sleeping villager. That's great loot. Chest. Eh. Eh. I'm taking your bed. But you know what? I will take these stacks of hay because I love stacks of hay because it means I don't have to go farm wheat. I can be lazy and it's awesome. Hmm. Ooh, this is a cool looking house. What do we got in here? What you got for Farsi, huh? Ooh, what do you got for trades? Eh, nah, I'll take your thing though. Thank you. I'm so mean. This is such a nice village. And you know what? In fact, I'm not going to steal their stuff. I'll put their workstations back. I just want their chests. That's all. Ooh. Yeah, I'll put this back. I don't want to mess with their stuff because I feel like villages are cut. Whoa, my screen's bugging out. I feel like villages are kind of cool when they have like a thriving ecosystem and it's not just like a ghost town. I like when there's actual villagers and stuff here. You know what I mean? Whoa, we're going into the into the forest. Oh, that was it. Imagine if there's like a for they got to add forest villages. Imagine a village like in one of these big forests. That'd be so cool. Meow. Oh, congregation. What's up? What are we talking about? Oh, what do we got? Empty map? No, I don't care about that. All right, your trade stink. We're moving on. I am taking your bells, though. You don't need these, right? I'll leave one. Nice guy, Farzy, huh? There's a witch hut over here. I should probably keep note of this, right? Do witches spawn in witch huts? That's one thing I've never known about Minecraft. Do witches actually spawn in these, or is it just like a relic? I really don't know. Oh, there's a cauldron here. You know what? Just in case, I'm going to put this in my journal. Just in case. I'll write down the coordinates. What are we at? 823. All right, boom. All right, I think we're getting close to, th yeah, we're getting close to 3,000. So I'm gonna start turning around here soon or just going like sideways, like this way. Ooh, a village in the forest, just like I wanted. Okay, perfect. Whoa, this is interesting. It goes into the, 
oak biome too. Okay. Hello. Oh, I like your clothes. Is that Gucci? Is that pro? Oh, he's like, yeah, it's Gucci. Particles out. <laughs> you got a cool horse stable too. You guys are cool. This is an awesome little place. Oh, the horses are escaping. Horse stable's broken. Oh my God, it's a baby fest. That sounds really strange. There's a ton of babies. It's a, a gaggle of babies. Where are you guys going? Hey, what? Are they playing? Oh, they're actually playing. That's so adorable. My heart. <laughs> All right, you guys run along. Be safe. I'm gonna steal your family's loot. <laughs> All right, that is good for here. I'll do one last flyover in this area, then I'm gonna go back. Oh, another portal here. Some obsidian, some fireballs. Okay, the loot's not terrible here. I won't lie, it's not terrible. Give me that secret gold block. Where is it? It's in here? It's here. Give me that gold block. Hold on. Eh. 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 Wait just a second. I see a ravine here. Is that big? Oh, okay. I'm hitting every block in the world. Is this a big ravine? It looks big. Eh. Eh. Oh. Oh. Um, I'm going to adventure this. This looks pretty deep. Whoa. Guys, it's the wall. Oh, that was an accident. I was going to say it's the 1.17 cave update. It came out. Ah! Ah! I'm not scared, you're scared. Hey, oh, hello. Okay, that's depressing. That cave literally had nothing in it. It just ended. All right, it's time for a pit stop to go back home, but I have something else I need to do today that also involves adventuring. So this is the adventuring episode. Oh, village, hold on. Whoa, look at this place. Hold on. Look at this. It's like a ravine. Is there a house down there? Oh no, it's just path, but that's still so cool. Look at this. Okay, hold my thoughts about going- what the- Minecraft, you're cursed. What the heck? What the heck? This is the coolest village of all time! Oh, bookshelves, I need these! Gimme, 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 gimme! You know what they say, good things come to those who wait. This is- what is this village? What is wrong with this village? Floating farm? Flower forest? Ravines? This is- it's so cool, but it's so weird. Ooh, loot. Wow, terrible chest. I'm sleeping in your bed now. That's punishment. Look at this view, a nice scenic like mountain view. This guy has the best house in the whole place. What's in here though? Nothing. Wow, terrible house. I hate it. <gasps> Wait, could it be a blacksmith? I forgot they still had these. I haven't seen one of these things in forever. What do we got? What do we got? <gasps> they nerfed the chests. Ooh, book. Okay, I'll take the one book, whatever. All right, I'm done here. I'm gonna go back home now. You know what this reminds me of? If you're old enough to remember this, back on the Xbox 360 edition of Minecraft, the world sizes were limited, so if you wanted to save room for new updates, you had to like, not explore your whole map. It was super crazy, but those good old days. All right, we have returned home. So, next up on our agenda, which as I said earlier, was also kind of an adventuring kind of plan, is I need to go to the nether and find something. All right, so our plan is to go find a nether fortress because we can't find any of these guys or even these guys. I used to have one before the nether update, but as I've already kind of alluded to earlier, I've reset my chunks a lot in this world, so I no longer have one. So yeah, we're gonna go fly around and find a nether fortress and raid it and have fun. But first off, we need to go get some gold armor because as you know, piglins will destroy you if you don't have gold on. So we're gonna go make a special piece of gold armor for this adventure. So let's go into the library and let's go see do we have any good books to put on this thing? Obviously I could do mending. I want protection. Where's protection? I need unbreaking, which I don't have any. Fire protection for sure. I have a couple of those. Wait, I'm dumb. I got two fire protections. What am I doing? Farzi, you're dumb. On second thought, I'm just gonna go enchant a whole new piece of armor because I don't know if I'm forgetting any important enchantments. My brain's just not working right now. So let's go to the old Enderman farm. Well, not old, it's brand new. Go to the Enderman farm and go make a new piece of armor. By the way, on my last live stream, we actually made a library out in our end base. So you'll see that in a second, but we made that on stream. And if you do wanna catch my streams, I usually stream on Saturdays around the same time I post these videos. But uh, yeah, Saturdays is when I stream. So if you wanna go watch me do some of this off camera work. That's where to find me. In we go. Okay, so if you missed the episode the other day, we made this end base with an Enderman XP farm. It's amazing. It's so OP. Look at this thing. Bop, bop, XP everywhere. It's amazing. But look at this new addition, little library. We can enchant in here. It's going to be magical. So let's get some XP. Why is my XP not moving? Look at my XP bar. What the heck is 
Oh, there's mending on my sword, you dumb farzy. Oh, that's not good. Why'd I do that? I That's actually really dumb. Because now I'm not getting the XP on the right thing. Okay, what if I... Oh, man. Right, I'll use my fist. How about that? <laughs> okay, never do that. Never put mending on your sword. Especially if you have XP farms. Why'd I do that? That was so stupid. I'm so dumb. Okay, if I'm lucky, I might have some wood somewhere in this end. Right, over there, that chest. Please, 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 please. Welp. BRB, I'm heading back. Wait! Why am I over here? I set my spawn point over here. I'm taking wood from you. Because you're mean. And you made me spawn here. Alright, we're back, but I'm grumpy. Okay, I'm just gonna take this sword here. I usually use this for killing skeletons, but I don't use this farm anymore, so... Give me that. Diamond sword? Sure. This is like some parkour. Oh my goodness. 360 no scope! Alright, we're back in here. And let's see, does it work? Yes, XP is being gotten. Okay, perfect. And I guess I'll put the frame for it right here, and I'll, when I'm not using it, I'll just put the sword back up there. I'm also gonna need a chest for lapis for the enchanting, so I guess I can just put that right here. Wait, that's a slab. That might be okay, actually, right? If I did this, and this, and then I made these wood. Boom. Boom. That's alright. I mean, it's not the best looking, but it's alright. What if I do it a little more? A little more, a little more. Alright, that's better. That's much better. So inside here, I'll put my lapis in there. And boom. Okay, we're all set. Nice little area for us. Let's make a bet. If I get over level 30, I will shave my eyebrow right now. Ready? We're safe. We are safe. Okay, let's grab... What do we want to make? We want to make some boots? Probably a helmet, right? A gold helmet? I'm down with a nether helmet. Alright, let's make a helmet. And let's enchant this sucker. Let's get... Uh, like 32 of these, I guess. And we'll go bada bing, bada boom, unbreaking. Please be more than that. Okay. Not terrible. Not terrible. Put all this stuff back. Now let's go back home and add some more enchantments to that thing. Because I want to be a really good helmet. I want this to be like my nether helmet. Like the helmet I always use for the nether. So let's go make that happen. Oh my gosh. I did it again. I'm wasting all my fireworks and I'm wasting your time and I'm wasting my time. My time is meaningless, but this is still annoying. How did I do it twice, man? How did I do it twice? We're back again. All right, where's a bed? Where's a bed I can sleep in? I need a bed right now. Move, move, I'm running to the bed. Right here, I'm sleeping. Okay, we're good. So I guess I'll put a mending on this helmet. What else can helmets even get? They can get like underwater stuff. I don't need that because I'm in the nether. Can't do fire protection because I already got protection on it. All right, well, I guess just mending and we're done then. So we'll do helmet, mending. There we go. And let's name this the Piglin Crown. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, pretty, pretty nice, right? Boom, the Piglin Crown has been created. Let's put this on our head. We are now a king of the piglins and let's go to the nether and adventure. Finally, it's been a while. I can't lie though, I've had a lot of fun just messing around and adventuring in this episode sometimes and i've said this in the past but in case you are new sometimes i don't like just building every single episode it can get kind of tedious and a little bit repetitive so it's always fun to have videos like this where i just can hang out and just like relax and just play the game like normal and as i always say i hope you guys appreciate that i hope you still enjoy the videos even though i'm not building like amazing gigantic structures every day but yeah, I really like these ones. All right, Farzy, you're being too sentimental. Let's go do what we gotta do, which is finding a nether fortress. Oh, wings. <laughs> nether fortress. So, I've explored a lot of directions already, but I feel like if we're gonna find one, it's gonna be this way, because this is like across the giant ocean. I'm just guessing here. So let's just, let's go explore. Oh, we turned blue. Anything over here? I love these giant skeletons. They're so cool looking. Show me something. Oh, a bastion. I think I've been here before, though. Yeah, I have. I've been. Oh! What are the odds I just fall into that thing? That giant lava blade. What are the odds? I just did it. Wait. We found one. <laughs> that was so fast. <laughs> how, how far are we? We're not even that far. We're only 800 blocks away. Okay. Don't mind if I do. Oh, I'm getting shot out. Okay, hold on. Let me get my, my gear on. Okay. Well, let's explore. Oh, there's a blaze farm right here. Or not farm spawner. Hey, I need these things. Hey, would you knock it? Why is there lava down already? What the heck's going on? Oh, lava spilling. Oh, that's why. Okay, hold on. I gotta get some blocks. Hey, you guys are rats. You rascals. Stop it. 
Well, the main reason I want to do this whole uh, finding another fortress thing is because I'm gonna die. It's because I had no way to get wither skulls, so I couldn't make any more beacons or fight the wither, which was really annoying. So that's why I wanted to find this place and go find some more withers, if I can even find one. This is a small fortress, huh? Yo, lava, you gotta chill, man. You gotta legit chill. Stop doing that. Stop spreading. You're annoying. Um, the heck? That's not good. Where's the rest of the fortress? Did I get a janked one? Is this one broken? Wait, no, there's, there's rooms up here, I think. Yeah, there is. Um, whoa, that goes far down. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh, here we go. There's like a center point in the room. The, this is where I think we can like find better rooms when you find these weird things. Does that make any sense? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> ah, what the heck, man? There's nothing here. I swear to God, if I found the only broken fortress in Minecraft, I'm gonna say mean things. Oh, there's- okay, we're good. Hello. Come here. I need you. Bop. Bop. Oh, I want your skull. Okay, well that's- hey. Knock it off. Oh, I'm withered. That's why. I really should make like a pathway uh, to get to this place so I don't have to fly through the mountains every time. So maybe next episode we can do that. I don't want to do it right now because that might take a long time. You know what? Why don't we just go check it out? Let's just go see- like get the coordinates to where the the portal is or the bridge is then we can see if maybe we can start the link up I'm not gonna do it all today that's for sure but if we can like get a little bit done today you know okay we're back here so let's get some coordinates i want this to all be on the same level so this is on what block is this 58 so 58 and really i can it can be any X or Y coordinate because I can just make another like pathway here or whatever. You know, I can expand the bridge a little bit, but this has to be the same height. So 58, I'm just gonna write it in chat just so I have like a general idea where the coordinates are. All right, now let's go back. This is risky. This is risky. This is very risky here. Uh, where's my fire? All right, we got it, ready? Ah, safe. Okay, we're here. There's normal skeletons here. That's weird. Um, okay, 58, 58. Wait, oh, we're too high. Okay, we could go down a little bit, I guess. Uh, hold on, hold on. Armor, on. I'm not dying here. Sorry. Would you knock it off, Tubby? That's what I thought. Okay, 58's like right here. Yeah, okay, so we could just... Oh, wait, but we're so... We're so far off, I think. Okay, here's the plan. We're gonna go like right over here in this area, and we're gonna dig down a bit and make a pathway here. Okay, so right here is 58, and if we made a pathway, it would go right next to the fortress, so that this is a fine location, I guess. Now, you know what? I'll put it over here more. I want it to be more in line with the actual structure, so this is a better spot right here. Okay, so that being said, let's just dig for a while and just see, can we link up in the general vicinity of where our bridge is? I don't know. Let's see. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, we've entered the jungle, I think. Yeah, we have. Okay, um, no, that's fine. No problem. Ah, lava, I hate you so much, dude. We're entering the danger zone, boys. We're over lava, and we're getting close to a lava lake. I'm a little scared, I'm not gonna lie. Well, we have an obstacle. A slight detour will suffice for now. Okay, this is scary land. There's skeletons here. This is a disaster waiting to happen. Nope! Big jellyfish man, go away! Go away! Go away. Get owned. Okay, we're right here. We're at the home stretch. We made it back just about, but I think this is gonna be very, very, very long. It's like a long journey to get back there. So I might not do like the whole tunnel design. I might just make like a walkway with like some iron bars on the side so I don't walk into the lava, but I might make it a little bit more simple because it's like 800 blocks. It's, it's a long way. I've been doing this for like half an hour, just placing blocks down. So yeah, that'd be a long, long time. Boom, we've landed. Oh good, I got some blocks in here. So let me show you what I mean. Here's what I wanna do. So as opposed to making this like three by three plus like iron bar walls design, I'll just do something like this where I'll go out by three blocks and this'll be a stone brick here in the middle as well. Then I'll put iron bars like here just as like a guardrail. So it's not gonna be like crazy protection but it's gonna give me some safety. I think I'll do that. And you know what? We made it this far. Let's just do it right now. I'm not going to be lazy. I'm just going to go do this right now. I'll be back in like, well, for you, it'll be like 10 seconds. For me, it'll be like 45 minutes. So BRB. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. Uh oh, just so you guys know how OP my armor is. Look at this. I put back on my netherite helmet 
this armor, I can just sit in lava. It's actually OP. Like, I'll be fine here. I'm not even worried anymore. Make a little ladder system. Uh, let me up. Uh. Oh, he's gonna fight me now. No, 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 that's not cool. Uh oh, that's not good. All right, helmet on. I'm, I'm a gold pig man. Don't worry about me. I'm good. I'm chill. Don't worry. All right, we're just putting down our final light sources, and I think we are all done. Well, I don't think. I know we're all done. That took forever. My guess was 45 minutes, right? That took two and a half hours. Two and a half hours for this little bridge, but it's worth it. It's over. I'm not going to complain. I mean, like, I'm glad I have it, but oh my goodness, that took so long. It was crazy. But I actually have so many new ideas now for the nether. Just being in here for so long, it gave me some inspiration for future projects. So one thing I want to do is I want to make, like, a nether... Almost like a castle. Like, I want to make a nether base, but like a big tall base with like different rooms. Not just like this big like hallway thing, but like a nice like circular building. I think that'd be a really cool idea. Also, I want to expand my nether lab. Like if we look inside this room, this wall here, totally filled, looks great. This wall here, maybe there's a few extra spots up and around the corners that we could put something in. But over here, these two walls... These are like totally empty, so I want to expand out this lab and have like this kind of a thing where every corner is being used on all the walls. So, so many future ideas, I'm really excited for that. But guys, that's enough for today, we did a lot of work and a lot of adventuring, so yeah, I'm gonna call it there. As the kids say, my carpal tunnel is uh, hitting pretty hard. But real quick though, I want to put my piglin crown on an item frame over here so I never forget to bring it into the nether. So maybe I'll put it like... Right? I mean, it's kind of a weird spot for it, but I guess... I guess that does the trick, right? Alright, Piglin Crown's right there. It looks so strange being there. Maybe I'll put it, like, right here instead. Is that a better spot? That still looks weird, because it's floating. Hold on. Alright, whatever. It's going there. I'm over it. Piglin Crown, there you go. Alright. Now it's time to do what we always do every single day at the end of the episode, which is getting the comment of the day. And today, in the comment rainbow, we have a new comment from someone who I believe is new. And this commenter's name is... Snakey Animations. I couldn't fit the S, but it's Animations. And Snakey says, You always inspire me to build things in my world, so thank you. So Snakey, you're welcome. Now guys, I just want to note one quick thing. If you didn't know this, I have a Discord where I have a big community there that we all talk and chat and send memes and stuff. So if you want to join that, link is down below. I'm trying to grow it more, so uh, yeah, that's my... That's my... Uh, I guess my sad attempt at trying to grow my discord, but <laughs> yeah, if you want to join links down below But yes, anyways on the comment. Thank you snakey. I appreciate that but guys can you break? Oh my goodness What I was trying to say is but guys. Thanks so much for watching Make sure to like subscribe do all the good stuff and I'll talk to you guys next time. So until then goodbye